So as a designer on the original Quake, um, it's really exciting to be announcing a brand new Quake game. Um, and one thing that I really want our fans to know is that, you know, the spirit of the true arena multiplayer competitive game uh, with, you know, the, uh, the feeling that, that people um, know and love from Quake uh, will be there in Quake Champions. The newest thing to Quake Champions is Champions. Uh, and one thing that we discovered with Quake is that everyone plays Quake differently. And you know, some people are very you know offensive in nature. Some people are defensive in nature. Um, so we have designed champions to fit your playstyle. Uh, so you can you can find the champion that best fits you. Then you can use their active ability to add depth in gameplay uh, to uh, the matches. And, and the active abilities really help also in team play. When we showed our announced trailer at the showcase, we highlighted four champions. We had Ranger, Nick, Scalebearer, and Bison. So uh, long time uh, Quake fans will recognize Ranger. Uh, Ranger's special ability is the Dire Orb. Uh, if you remember from Quake 1, that's how you killed the boss. You, you teleported to the Dire Orb, so that's what their act his act ability is. Then we have Visor, which is a classic character from Quake 3. His special ability is his uh, piercing eye, where he's piercing sight where he can see uh, uh, opponents. And then we have two new characters that are new to the franchise, Nyx. Uh, she's very fast, very light, and she can phase in and out. Uh, then of course, uh, the last character is Scalebearer. is a big, tough champion, and his special ability is the Bull Rush. And you don't want to be standing in front of Scalebearer when you Bull Rushes. My favorite champion of the four that we showed so far is Nyx. Uh, she's very fast. Uh, you know, I like to kind of hide out of combat, so I use her uh, phase ability to sneak into combat, hit someone with the rail, and then get out as fast as possible. 